Hey guys, happy Sunday. How are you guys all doing today? It's kind of weird right now. I have my camera on my tripod, so instead of having my hand out like this to talk to you guys, I just kind of have it set up on my desk. Um, I made sure my cat Fred was not in the room this time, though, because last time I tried to film um, with the tripod, he was up in my lap the whole time, which would have been fine, except then he decided to move onto the desk, and all you guys could see, if any of you remember, was his tail swishing back and forth, and he knocked the camera over like three times, so most of the video is just me going, oh gee, no, and like trying to catch my cat. So anyway, I thought I'd give the tripod another try. I feel like I need to adjust it down a little. Um, I haven't checked the angle, so hopefully I'm actually filming myself right now and not like my forehead and like behind me. I don't know, but we'll see. Um, I flail my hands around a lot more, I guess, when I don't have a camera to like anchor them. So honestly, I kind of do prefer to make vlogs with the camera in my hand. It helps me like gather my thoughts and stuff. But I figured, you know, if I don't switch it up a little bit, it won't be very interesting for you guys. Um, let's see, that was, I don't know, I just had a million things. The first thing I wanted to say to you guys was to any of my new subscribers, thank you so much for subscribing, welcome to my channel, I really hope you guys like it, um, I try to keep a balance, because I do daily vlogs, and so you guys who are subscribed to me are going to see me in your subscription box every single day. And I try to keep it varied for that reason. I am really, really passionate about eyeshadow and makeup. But I know I have viewers that aren't really passionate about eyeshadow and makeup. So I'm always trying to catch the stuff going on around the house, like follow me around stuff. Um, my sister's still working on the Yellow Brick Road, and I have been filming little snips here and there for you guys. So look forward to it. It's going to be like a bonus video all its own of all the footage I've collected since the last Home Depot hell excursion that I had to go on which sucked so bad. I don't know what I have against home improvement stores. I think maybe it's because when I was little it was the only thing my dad was ever like willing to do was go to a Home Depot so we spent like the whole weekend like up and down the aisles all the time and I just remember it not being very much fun. I never had like an activity and like all I ever wanted was one of those awful brownies and a cactus cooler out of the vending machines that used to be all the way in the back of the store of course they're all the way in the back because then you have to walk through all the stupid stuff to get to the stupid things. Anyway, um, home improvement stores are not for me, so that's that. Anyway, the point was you guys will get a video of the start to finish soon. I'm actually going to take the camera. Oh, that was my phone. I got a coin. <laughs> I'm getting text messages. I'm going to take the camera out in a little bit and I will film some more because we were painting bricks all morning. I have had a yellow streak on my hand. I don't know if it's going to show up at all because there's so much shimmer and makeup on my hands, but there's a yellow streak on my hand. I was painting bricks with my sister, so that was kind of fun. It was nice to have a project that we were working on together, so I appreciate that. Um, as far as today's video, guys, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if any of you watched yesterday's video. I said I was waiting for my friend from Malibu to come see me. He was ended up, he was ended up, I, I can't speak. I should really plan these things out before I just start rambling. He wasn't ever able to make it out here yesterday. Um, he's working a lot right now, and he was really tired. So I just sat around the house. I think I ran more errands with my sisters. Um, yesterday was pretty uneventful, to tell you the truth, but that's okay. Um, one day seems to kind of run into the next without work, which I'm still looking for a job, guys. I want you to keep sending the good vibes and keep your fingers crossed for me. I still haven't driven except for that one time for 10 minutes. I hate it so much guys I hate it so much but I need to work on that I need to get comfortable with driving because I need to have my license by December it's a personal goal that I set for myself so we'll see um anyway I don't know what else I had planned on telling you guys just wanted to thank you all for being here and watching me I will be back later with something else to show you I guess so right now guys, I'm babysitting my sister's puppy, which is silly to say because she lives in the next room over. Babysitting kind of implies like I'm watching it, but this little puppy right here, this naughty, innocent looking beaky faced puppy, she knocked over Karen's coffee and spilled it all over Karen's iPhone. Karen is not particularly pleased with the dog right now dog also walked through the yellow paint, but that was more funny than anything because it's non-toxic and we can totally wash it off. 
but that's what I'm doing. I am watching her, and she has been, she's so cute, she's so good, but she's such a pain in the butt, and she's so bad, too. She keeps going under, I have an extra, I'm trying to gather my thoughts here, it's as if you guys under, uh, blah, 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 let me start that over. I have an extra bed in my room, because my room is very big, and my sister needed me to store it for her, and the puppy keeps going under the extra bed in my room and pooping. And I've sprayed it with that stuff, and I go under there, under there and scrub it, like, immediately when it happens, because I'm not about to, like, sit in a room that stinks like that. It's so gross. But she keeps going back over and over. At, like, 2 in the morning, I was cleaning her poop out from under the bed. And we've been taking her out, like, at least once an hour if she's awake, guys. It's not like we're just neglecting her to run around and, like, relieve herself wherever. She goes out all the time. But I didn't think we'd have a problem today for some stupid reason. I guess I'm just that bright. Um, but yeah, two in the morning I was cleaning up her poop, and then this morning Karen dropped her on my bed when she had had enough of her, and I got up, and by the time I had pulled myself together 15 minutes later, there were two poops under the bed. One was brand new, the other one was probably from earlier this morning. I, th I know that's disgusting, I'm really sorry to be telling you guys all about it, but I'm frustrated because I'm not used to having an animal that doesn't isn't completely housebroken and the fact that she's making a habit of going back to the same spot over and over is stressing me out a little so do any of you guys have any good suggestions um i don't really i'm not that good with dogs i'm better with cats i've had cats my whole life we've only had dogs off and on and when we do have dogs they're boxers so i'm used to them but the training part anybody have any helpful hints comment below if you know anything about making a dog not go somewhere or special tricks or things i could do to teach her stuff because maybe is a very disobedient little guy girl girl i keep forgetting we haven't had a girl dog in a long time anyway guys i'm gonna go for now i just had to rant sorry that was all about dog poop don't you wish i was talking about nail polish now guys i fear i am literally going to spend my entire day watching little miss puppy face sleep combination of she's super cute and there's nothing else going on. I don't mean to complain, but I want something to do. <gasps> Random question, guys. Would you be interested in following me on Twitter? I've had a Twitter account for about a year now, and I don't know if anyone is following me at all. I've actually never tweeted once. Not once. The only reason I made a Twitter account is so that I could follow the people that I was interested in following on Twitter, and I don't even have an iPhone, and the phone that I do have is super lame, so unless I'm using my sister's iPad, I can't even follow Twitter the way people are supposed to follow Twitter. But the point is, I do have a Twitter account. My username is Solitary Misfit, just like my YouTube channel. And comment below and let me know if you guys would be interested in following my tweets, because I will start tweeting if you guys actually are interested. So, like I said... Solitary Misfit on Twitter, the same as my username, here on YouTube. If you guys follow me, I will start tweeting. I just had a random thought and felt like tweeting it, but I was like, you know, there's no point in beginning to tweet now. You don't know if anybody wants to follow you. So if you guys do, you'll get tweets. I promise. And if not, it's okay, because I've literally never tweeted once, and I would only be doing it if you guys wanted it. Let me know. Okay, guys, so Megan came over, and she and I are... Say hello. Hello! <laughs> are about to play Mario Party. I don't know if you can see that. It looks really bright on my, on my camera, monitor, whatever. Anyway, we're about to play Mario Party, and I just figured I'd let you guys know so that you would have something to look forward to, because when we're done playing, we'll show you who won. And it might not even be one of us. It could be one of the computers. So, wish us luck. Good luck, us. Yay. <laughs> and we'll be back at the end to tell you who. Okay, won. so for anybody who didn't know, I suck at Mario Party, except for Mario Party 7, which we didn't play. We played Mario Party 5. And today's winner is, I don't know if you can see him, Yoshi. And guess who was Yoshi? Yay, me. Yay, Megan. She totally kicked my butt guys i ended the game with zero stars and nine coins so that just goes to show how well i did anyway i'm gonna end today's video now so i hope you guys are all having a great sunday i hope your weekend was really really good and i will see you all tomorrow